Even though that is not mentioned in any part of the Bible. Hey guys, once again, welcome back to this platform and my name is Emma Adonis. In today's video, we are going to be looking at something that is urgently happening in Nigeria. The federal government has put minors into prison over raising the Russian flag. You know, there was a demonstration that took place in Kanu state. So that's where a lot of uh, protesters actually protested for uh, hunger in the country. So some people were seen raising the Russian flag and the federal government actually indicated that this is a threat to them and also said that they are committing treason or they are in the act of treason. So they were charged to court for treason. They want to overthrow the government. That's what they are saying. But what is surprising is that those that the police arrested or the federal government arrested were minors they were not the adults that were demonstrating on that day raising the russian flag so a lot of people are contemplating a lot of people are complaining about these uh, actions of the police or the federal government but before everybody gets to know this news it was very dark man that actually exposed this kind of news because he was also arrested and he was released on bail for two million naira so as he was about to go, he realized that there were a certain um, uh, number of kids that were detained in the same prison cell. They were detained over there. Over three months now, they were still there. And some of them were laying. You can see that some of them has nothing to do with like they are not eating. They are not doing a lot of stuff. So very dark man decided to broadcast the news and say, this is what is currently going on. So a lot of people reacted. But let's see very dark man's own opinion on this matter. Ten years old boy, and me and this boy, this I said, apparently these are the boys that the Tinubu government arrested, that they were flying Russian flag. All these children were still like this now, they go to prison because they could not secure bail for them. They are going to the prison now, they could not secure bail for them. Now the question is this, what does this boy know about flag? This boy does not even have a basic education, let alone knowing that he flew a flag. So you are charging all these kids for treason. Me, I just came out of uh, I just came out of cell and I was with them. That's the previous part. This morning I was going to pee when I woke up. I was going to pee when I saw this boy. I was like, this boy is my children. So now we came to court, they could not grant their bail, they have adjourned the case. So where are they going to sleep? They are going to sleep beside the cell again. And already they'll stay for more than 90 days. Today is the 93rd day, 93 days for all the children seated everywhere. Today is the 93 one boom. Which food? Which food only? Size boy did. And all the way from Kano. Where are they carrying from? From Kano. They brought them from Kano to Abuja. Where's their parents? Their parents now go to cry. No one. See them. All these are kids. Ten years old. How old are you? Best condition. Fourteen years. All of them are less than seventeen years old. It's crazy. It's crazy and it's not fair. Come on. So that's very dark man's own opinion on the matters. But what is even as a matter of fact is more disturbing is that during the court arraignment, when the children appear in court, a lot of them collapses on the spot. <laughs> so this is what got people uh, more angry at the federal government again because these children were not being filled with it's like they were not having a good time of 
eating they were not eating they were not treating them well so you can see that a lot of them collapses on the point but vdm came out to break another news of how the children are going to be built the federal government has initiated each of them should pay 10 million naira on bill and a lot of people are complaining that if these children or these people has that 10 million naira each they won't be out on the street protesting for hunger and it is true if they have that kind of money they won't be out there protesting that hunger is disturbing them hunger is striking them hunger is killing them in the society or in the country so very dark man came to what post that and also this is a comparison between the house uh, member so this guy was uh, initiated a bill of 500k and these children were given 10 million each and you can see that there's a disturbing coincidence over here so the picture has been trending and a lot of people are talking about it let's look at somebody people that talk about the issue all oh, nigerians look at the bail condition that have been set for these minors that the nigerian government are currently holding in detention they said each of those minors will pay 10 million naira each, two shorties each. Each one should be each one should be a civil servant and the other one should be a family member, i.e. parent or siblings. The civil servant should produce employment letter, last promotion letter, two passport and valid ID. Valid ID of any means. Minors are to be remanded at a bostal home, while adult suspects are to be remanded at Kuje. Now if these children get 10, 10 million naira with a protest, need I remind the Nigerian government that the reason why people protested is because of the hardship of the country and the fact that the Tinubu administration were not even doing anything in their power to at least remove us out of our suffering. Also, need I to remind you people that, again, all these children were on a carry. There is no video anywhere where they flew any flag. The last time I checked, now adult I see with flags. Do you understand? Now, adults, I see with flag, meaning say all these children, they just they follow what their elderly ones they do. They don't know any better. These children are supposed to be put in a juvenile home. You educate them, you teach them. Mind you, you pick these children from Kano. Kano is one of the states that have the worst education in Nigeria. One of the worst education in Nigeria is in Kano. All the northern states. All the northern states. Worst education. No school, they are being affected by terrorism and a lot of things that is hindering those kids from going to school. So they don't even know any better. So to think, okay, yes, you are alleging them that they flew a flag, you should educate them, President Bola and Chirubu's government. Please, these children are minors. I sat down, I sat down with them this morning when I woke up. I was like, wait, what, the, what, what is going on? They were sitting now exactly close to the pool, that is where they slept. See the other one, don't dry and bone, don't dry, finish. I look this student like this, I won't cry. That was why immediately I left the court when they granted me bail. I went straight to that place. Straight. Because I wanted to be sure that I was not crazy. That this government don't really love children of 10 years, 11 years, 12 years, 13 years, 14 years. I didn't see anyone of 18 years. I wanted to be sure. And I went there and I was sure. They put them inside the dock. A lot of them were on the ground. I was like, what is going on? President Bola mentioned, please release these children. Please release them to their family. This bad condition is too harsh. It's too harsh. Please, President Bola mentioned, government, please release these children to their family. Please. All right. So the case is still ongoing. And the Council of Defendants is asking the federal government to release uh, those kids because they have nothing to do with the russia flag they are not a threat to the federal government they are threat to themselves and also the uh, council of uh, federal government also see those kids as not case but adults married people that are protesting trying to destabilize the government trying to destabilize the nation they want to ruin the democracy that they have fought for for many years let's listen to the two of them
this young person has been arrested since the second day of August, 2024. No food. Over three months. No food. They've been garbage. left without clothing, garbage. without housing, without proper care. They are looking very malnourished. No as you can see the videos that are flying around social media. So from that they are taking garbage. only they were kept at the Kuje Correctional Center police and at the IRT, the notorious IRT, look at IRT. fast abattoir. At Sasa, 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 now, this is the facility that has held our young children oh, that have been kept by this government over allegations of attempting to overthrow the president. The question now comes to how can a 12, 13, 14 year old boy who is looking very frail and malnourished attempt to overthrow the president? That is a matter for another day. These boys that we brought to the court today, all of them are adults. Most of them are married men. None of them is a minor. Some of them are university graduates. The small, small kids you are seeing here, they came with some of their parents to come and greet their loved ones. They are not even the real suspect standing trial in this case. These boys were arrested in Kaduna and Zaria. These young boys are trying to destabilize Nigeria using the Russian flags and other countries, calling on the military to remove our president. Is it fair to even remove the state governors that they don't want democracy again? If you don't like democracy, are we forcing you? You go back home and sit. Guys, that's what is currently happening. Also, ACP, Oluwaiwa, Adejobi also came out to speak on the issue. He is saying that those kids can go to prison. So only the ones that cannot go to prison is below seven years. When they are below seven years, they can't go to prison. But when they are above or they are seven years, you can go to prison. It's crazy. It's crazy. But let's listen to his own point of view. Uh, those that are not criminally liable under the law, those are the people that are young ones below the age of seven. Once you are more than seven, you can be charged to court. The only thing is that you need to follow certain procedures to do that. But none of them is less than seven. I think the, the, the youngest should be 13. The fact that you are 13 year old uh, doesn't mean you cannot be charged to court. So anybody, even in the child, child, children and young persons act, they can still charge you to court because you are 13 year old, you can go to court. So the, we have charged them to court for this. On behalf of the federal government of Nigeria, the police has taken the bull by the horn because these are those who actually are leveraged on the end bad governance protest. They are jacked the protest and they are so violent. They were the people that are flying the Russian flags and many foreign, foreign flags which of course, you know, is a punishable offense. So they are criminally liable. We have not charged any underage in our own context here, the court. For those who have been following trends of engagement with uh, social media influencers and content creators, you know we have been engaging them for a very time. And we, even this department has made more than three or four statements concerning that, to condemn uh, unlawful, authorized use of police uniform or accoutrement. Not only the police. You can't use any law enforcement uniform. The military, the police can't use their uniform to act. You guys can see that a lot is happening in Nigeria. So some of the celebrities came out to react to the issue concerning the federal government detaining those cases. Nice video in the past. I don't already ask questions to where they ask. Who send them? You know that your usual question where some of you they ask. I don't already ask them in the past. But if there's something you must give this guy today, is his flowers. Everything today, I believe, happens for a reason. I never knew this uniform issue with the Nigerian police authority would lead him to see these children. I'm sure some of your celebrities, your favorites, know about this. But what are they doing with their platform? Imagine Nigerian government locking up under eight children all because they flew a different country's flag. What education do these children have to know which is what flag? Look at how malnourished they are looking. This guy never even solved his own problem finish. He carried their own forehead. Ask me again who VDM is and I'll show you this video.
Oh, my make see something. When I see this video, where that man posted, when I see this video, where that man post of this Muslim children with government arrest because then they fly Russia and um, flag during the um, protests, I'll be waiting. You understand? When I see the video, I say, make I tell you now something. You see this very dark man, you see this video, yeah? If you know like, I'm, like I'm, if you know like, I'm, if you know like in Karata, if you know like, I'm maybe because you don't quarrel with celebrity where you know, you don't call your friend, and you don't call your family member out, you don't spoil place where you do business. For example, now, make I say, be Jenny's Glow family member, you understand? And you know, say, now he spoil Jenny's Glow business, you understand? Now he make Jenny's Glow, Jenny's Glow need to sell organic cream again. Now she they sell wire, she they sell condemn robber slippers, she they sell all this fairly use them Nokia charger and all those them um, Motorola phone them I just say she the hog she the hog wire now for traffic you understand all this um, cable extension they say extension see they say now with a reliable source tell me you understand now video and Poshua come up from market if you don't like them because of that reason maybe because he be told to DK supporter and they don't follow your, your superstar quarry or you don't call a celebrity where you know before but you know you know if you take away one thing video is doing a good job this boy is a better person this boy is the only person be say if they look out for Nigeria citizens if you look at well look, many people they tell you but he own he own he own in the go extreme in the go extreme you understand since Bob Risky they enter prison but Brisky never come out for prison one day say, ah, I see one person for prison, you know? I can't repeat the person. Once Bob Brisky come out for prison, then they throw party for him. Then they throw party for him, then go they massage in BBL, they massage in low position. But see very dark man, as he enter the prison, he they look out for innocent people like him. He they ask questions, you understand? He they come out, they say, if not be him, now nobody go to say small, small children, they for prison. I'm seriously in Nigeria, when we see truth, make we talk, and this boy, they try, you understand? This boy is doing very, very well. First thing, if to say, you know, enter this prison, like to say, they no arrest him yesterday. Who for no say those small, small boys, then they for prison, you understand? When I know how many times Bob Brisky don't enter prison, this year, Bob Brisky don't enter prison 400 and 492 times, you understand? All the prison in the world, if you come out for corridor, I'm saying the carry face come out. If you even, if you even greet her, hey, talk to my finger, talk to my finger, and they are baby, they are baby, we see later, baby, when they arrest me again, I'll come and shake you, you understand? Now, saying they take them out from prison, you understand? But see, very dark man, you see, I'm putting my to the thing. If not be him, who go not say small, small children, they for prison? Who go not say APC, oh Lord, the Bruku APC, Tunupu and the children, they not arrest people for prison, innocent people, children, you understand? So when, when we see truth, make we talk, even if you don't like the boy because he not spoil your sister business, you don't quarry with celebrity where you like, you don't fight your family member. If you see through, talk and make under no fire you. May God no punish you through your left leg, you understand? If you talk truth, you no go die. I see what they even pay me for these children where they arrest. Now the bail condition then they give them. See the kind, see the kind bail condition that they give these children. Say make each of them bring 10 million naira. And see those these children now they be like people say their parents, their mama and papa put together, they no get rich, they no get it three thousand five hundred naira inside their account, you understand? He say make them bring 10 million. Make on a here, make on a here and here for a mouth. Fellow Nigerians. Look at the bail condition that have been set for these minors that the Nigerian government are currently holding in detention. They said each of those minors will pay 10 million naira each, two shorties each. I don't say they say they bring 10 million naira. Tell me these children, their papa, their mama, their extended family, put all of them together. I know she'll say they get 50,000 naira inside their country, understand? Now they say they bring 10 million. Seriously, when when one person do what thing good, make one they appreciate them. As a day, and I very dark man do something no good tomorrow, I go talk them. And they talk about every other celebrity, understand? As a day, any celebrity will make will do what thing no good. I go. I don't I don't want to be anybody friend, you understand? I need to do something for anybody to like me or notice me or to repost me, you understand? I don't come this life country for one. I do something for myself. I they talk because I like to talk, you understand? Whether you like me or you don't like me, or there is nothing you can do to me. I'll be manager. I'll be manager, you understand? Now me be the number one manager for UK. If you don't like him, shame on you. Psycho, I dedicate this song to to President Tunubu and all the people carrying those children go put for prison so that Tunago get sense. Kabi Yesio, Udarao, Emi Jesu Christi, Yoba Aremu, Emi Lei, Emi Yewa, Emi Pio Pio Pio, Emi Jesu, Emi Jesu Christi, Yoba Aremu, Kabi Yesio, Udarao, Emi Jesu Christi, Yoba Aremu, you go hard before Nigeria go better. Guys, what do you think about the whole story or the whole issue happening in Nigeria? You can see that everything is messed up. What are your opinion on this matter? Do you think the federal government will release those kids or those kids supposed to face the consequences of their action as the federal government see them as threats for raising the Russian flag? Whatever you think, just drop it in the comment section. Thank you for watching this channel.